But the woman was like, no, can you guys get a picture with my husband because he likes black girls? Welcome to another Nikki Grace Thoughts. Um, point number one, I know I look crazy. I feel like I say that all the time. Do I say that all the time? Like I look crazy? No, but this time I'm being serious. I'm sick. <laughs> okay, I'm not sick. Okay, I was sick. I still feel a bit weird, but I've been laying in bed all day, so that's why I look kind of crazy. Let me stop looking. L let me stop making excuses. <laughs> as to why I look so crazy but I just feel like I want to give you a bit of a backstory like today isn't Sunday I'm actually pre-recording again because I'm going to be busy on Sunday I also really wanted to get this video out as well I know Greece was ages ago now but I still wanted to you know tell you about my experience and what it was like sorry if the camera's flashing I can't tell until after I've stopped the video that is flashing so sorry if it's doing that throughout the whole thing like <clears throat> it's not my intent <laughs> um yes but I wanted to give you guys my experience about Greece and stuff so yes guys I have I wrote down five points because I like to stick I don't like to babble I know I babble a little bit but I try to not babble too much by giving myself bullet points that I need to stick to so number one in Greece, Holkadiki, Holkadiki, Chokadiki, Holkadiki, <laughs> there's so many cats, like, everywhere. Like, they're not owned by anybody. Like, they're just cats, like, everywhere, in the restaurants, on the streets, in people's houses. Like, literally, we were sat there eating food at the outside bit of the restaurant, and then there's just cats, like, going in and out of your feet at the dinner table. Like, it's just so... Like, it's just so strange and it's so weird. Like, in the UK, when you see a cat, 99% of the time it will be owned by somebody or it will have a collar on, you know what I mean? Like, to have, to see so many stray cats. They don't even need to go to the pet shop. Buy a cat? Why? Just take one off the street. Like, it's not that deep. And I don't understand why it's that way or why it's just a normal thing. I don't know, but there were just cats everywhere like so many too many to count um like they were so cute as well but i didn't know where they'd been so i didn't touch any but there was just so many <laughs> number two the beaches well we went to this one beach in particular and it was nothing i'd ever seen in europe before then again i haven't been traveling that much so maybe they are beaches like that and i just haven't seen it yet but there was just the beach we were at it was like something you'd see on Google images in a Caribbean island. Like it was crazy, like the type of blue and how calm it was, it just didn't make any sense. Like it was so, so nice. So that really caught me off guard. I was like, oh my goodness. Like why is it so nice? There's definitely nice beaches in Europe. Like I'm not trying to kill off Europe, but a beach like that in particular blew me away. I was like, oh my goodness. <laughs> You know them ones where you have to walk up to it to make sure it is real because it just didn't make any sense. Like, it was breathtakingly beautiful. Like, the pictures that I took in front of the beach makes it look like I have taken a picture, Google image from Google, and it was like I took myself and cropped myself out of an old picture and added it to there. Like, it just, it didn't look real. Like, it looks strange, so if people don't believe me, then that's fine, because the picture looks fake, the sea looks fake, but, you know, it was real. It was so real that it was surreal, you know what I mean? I'm just saying. Three was the biggest shocker. So when I, so when we got there, um, when we went to town, to the beach, people was looking at us. Like, looking at us, looking at us. They weren't even being subtle about it. Do you know, like, if you see a bus go by, and it has an advert on it, so you kind of watch the bus as it goes. That's what people were doing. They was watching us. It's not like they look and turn away. They look and they keep on looking and they keep on looking. And it's like, what? 
<laughs> like it was so strange. What well, first, I didn't know if it was like a racial thing. Because how am I supposed to know? I never really um, experienced anything like it before. So I was like, is it just a racist place? They don't like black people. And it was kind of hard to miss us because my whole journey, I don't remember seeing any other black person there. And there was like eight of us, I think. So, you know, you could really miss us. And everyone was just staring. And then it wasn't until we went to the club that someone mentioned, I think, to one of my sisters that black people, it's just like a new thing for them. Like they don't really see black people in that part of Greece. So it was more out of the fact that they were intrigued. They just hadn't really seen black people. I don't wanna say before, cause I don't know if it's that deep, but the way they was looking at us made it feel like we've never even seen black people ever, except on TV. Like that's how deep it was. So there's one day when we was on the beach and my sister, two of my sisters, um, and I think it was my cousin as well. I can't remember. We went off anyways to go see if there was any excursions near, near, nearby. And so anyways, they came back maybe about half an hour later. And it was like, so a couple, you know, girl and boy, man and woman, stopped him and was like, oh, can we get a picture? So my sister thought, you know, she would take a picture of the couple with the beach behind them. But the woman was like, no, can you guys get a picture with my husband because he likes black girls. What? Like, excuse me? <laughs> what? <laughs> uh, okay. Like, what? Like, literally, it, it's just so weird. Like, it's just so strange. Like, people want a picture with you because they just wasn't used to seeing our race. Like, so, you know, at one point I felt like a celebrity. I'm like, okay. Like, I know it wasn't me that got asked the picture. Actually saying that. <laughs> I then went to the club, I think this was on the last night, and there was a guy who asked for me and one of my sister's pictures as well. So if you find us on some random Greek guy's Instagram, probably putting us up for sale, you'll know, you'll know that, it, that you'll know the situation in it. No, I'm joking, I hope they won't put us up for sale. <laughs> like trafficking, I always was thinking about taking the film, I don't know why, um, but yeah, if you find us on some random you know guys Instagram it's just it's just us you know it's just us and when we went to actually when we went to both clubs because I think we went to about I think we only went to two but they were slyly videoing us and recording us and I didn't see it on the first time I went to the club but I did see it on the second time like they're trying to be so sly about it me I don't care like if you want to take a video take a video in it but um, I wasn't too bothered, but it's the fact that they have to go to extremes of having to take a video because they'd never seen us. And the club was so packed, so packed. And to say I didn't see one black person, that's crazy. Like that's, that's, that's mental to me. So yeah, that was really strange. Like they just, black people is just really not a thing there <laughs> in that part of Greece. Obviously I can't say the whole of Greece because I haven't been to the whole of Greece, but in that particular area, Seeing black people was so intriguing for the people there. So it was like completely different for them. It was it was completely different for me because I it's not like I'd experienced that before. So it was strange for me too. Um, point number four kind of relates to number three with the whole clubs. Uh, people don't dance a lot or at all in, in these, in Greece, in this part of Greece. Like, it's like they're literally tree every club like how i would see a bar so from my point of view a bar is where you go there's music playing in the background but you just kind of sit down and have drinks and talk and chill whereas me from a club aspect is you go you may get drinks or whatever but everyone's up and dancing the first one was more of a bar to be fair but the second one was definitely a nightclub and still people wasn't really dancing. After a while it did get super packed, so I understand that you could barely move, but before that, no one was really dancing at all that much. Like, in the second club we went to, which was massive, you could maybe pinpoint a few people that was doing a bit, maybe like shoulder moves or a bit of, you know, swaying. But other than that, people just come to drink, talk, smoke. Oh, cause you can smoke inside as well. That was a new thing for me smoking inside a building um yeah 
and drink and talk and smoke and sit like literally that is it people don't really dance so <laughs> people are looking at us like we're crazy i'm like but where there's music you should be dancing like that's normal like why are you not dancing i don't get it um it just seems strange for them to dance and it was like what like how do you go to a club and not dance like why are you there like why are you there i just don't understand again i was like okay i didn't care we didn't care we just, we danced anyway but yeah in general people just didn't dance um so we were just doing our own thing like nothing new <laughs> literally nothing new um which drew more attention to us even though we had a lot of attention on us anyways because we were black but so dancing didn't really help but um yeah interesting and the fifth and final point i did feel like we got treated special by the people in greece not like where we were staying but like just the people who lived in Greece, um, like around the towns and stuff. The only reason why I say that is because when we went to this last nightclub, there was a queue of people, a queue of people waiting to get into this nightclub. Then eight of us stumble across this club. We didn't even know what type of club it was. Like we all came in flats. Like we didn't even think it was that deep and it happens to be really deep, but we came, didn't even know how to get in or, whatever whatever anyways this man stopped us and he was like do you have are you someone like have you booked in or are you on the wait list or the guest list or anything and we were just like no so i just thought he was gonna say join the queue he was like no problem come this way so i'm like okay coming through like okay people in the queue bye <laughs> don't know how long you've been stood there for <laughs> like it was just so weird and I, I don't understand why we got let in for free in front of everybody else like it made no sense whatsoever but it happened anyway so i was just like yeah this is what i'm talking about <laughs> so i was like yeah okay like feeling on top of the world right now like <laughs> We just get let in like a red carpet just pulled out for us real quick just so we can go in like oh my gosh So yeah, that was really good. Like that was really cool um, But all together it was such an amazing holiday um, My tan's going now. So finally <laughs> It took a while But it was such a good Holiday I definitely go back. I don't know if I go back to the exact same place just because this world is too big Do you know what I mean? Not because I didn't like it, but the world is just massive, so to go back to the exact same place again, I don't think so. But I'd definitely like to go back to Greece again, because Greece was so nice, it was so lovely. Um, and the people were so welcoming, so yeah. Guys, we have come to the end of Nikki Grace's thoughts. Please let me know what you thought. Um, and if you've been to Greece, and if you can relate to anything similar, yes, let me know. <sighs> It's nice to be back. <laughs> Make sure to like, comment, share, and subscribe. And click on the bell button for post notifications so you can get all my videos as they come through. Guys. <laughs> we are out. Bye.